What is up, legends? It's your boy Scion. We are back, and I have a second impressions on this game to actually do. And a lot of people want me to do more videos in this game, so we're gonna get more videos in this game. I like to start by thanking everybody. on um, the content for this actually does uh, really well. You guys watch it for a long time, and um, it's very encouraging when it goes forward to me actually, you know, you know, taking a look at the game further and helping people out. Um, just in my sense, I'm not a whale. Well, this is a $25 account. That's literally how much I spent. Mainly, most of it was on getting the, the SVIP permanently. And then I got the $5 packs that come with the select summon. I did it for Anna and I did it for Maki. And that's how, how much money I spent. I didn't even buy the skin for Finnebeth because I'm not sure I'm going to keep Finnebeth at this point. Um, she's okay, but I may not need her anymore the way that i originally originally used her um she's actually kind of getting phased out at this point which is unfortunate because she's a dark-skinned waifu but i still have the just giaru standing in front of me right now for antiva who i use who i still like to use um but we'll see um uh, fender beth isn't necessarily out of the ballpark yet but she might get replaced soon sadly you know it is what it is that's how it works um you can't get attach the characters like that you have to worry about you know your progression and winning and it's not that she doesn't help with it but she doesn't really do much right now because i have all the all these other characters that do stuff like i can use yuffie the same way as well it, it kind of depends on who gets duped and that's what we're going to go into now you saw the title by far and i'm totally committing to saying this this by far is the most re-rollable and the most flow based game of all time in android history right now you can re-roll easily and get the stuff that you want because the sheer amount of codes that they gave us gives you such a head start and such a good start that you can get miyuki at the start or um frantiva as you can see right here depending on what you do frantiva is more single target install um yuki is more burst and rage down so it depends on what you want to do you can go either or i went um single target install because it just makes things easier but you can do the same thing with yuki they kind of it doesn't matter to be honest with you. the only thing that matters is nicole is useless without her being fully maxed so just don't use her um but with that said the reason why that is the most flow based is because you could, all you have to really know is understand is how this game works and what is going to push you towards i said it before in a video about two or three weeks ago that on um, the way that this game works is it pushes you in two different directions and it's going to actually encourage you and kind of enforce that you're either going to start by doing normal where you actually you know do your stages and just push yourself through and as long as you have enough power to actually do the stages, which you see i overdo the on um, the stages i'm gonna show you why i'm gonna tell you why that i'm like not that far in stages yet um because there's an actual power curve in this game and me being this far ahead really kind of doesn't mean much anything because when you fight the bosses they automatically push themselves up to much towards the cp so the cp where i'm at right now just kind of doesn't really matter so you reach a point where you're going to do the stages and it's going to be a little bit hard or not hard but it's going to be according to two different things one is going to be according to how well you built your characters which are your characters strong enough for the, the level of my characters are more than strong enough as you guys can see how you built your team because your power means something now you can overpower a stage and still lose if your team is not built properly if you don't have tanks to actually take damage or if your dps is not strong enough dps not strong enough single target not strong enough aoe then you can actually lose being well powered over what the cp level is because your team is built improperly so you need to pay attention to characters for those particular roles now for me maki is my single target on um, character that i need to actually do that type of damage uh, i have other characters come in like gimme um my cc because you need strong cc and people who are going to be detrimental so that's where miyuki um shiki and finnebeth comes in you also have barnarius as a tank who can actually do a little bit of uh crowd not crowd control a little bit of aoe damage 
and that actually helps out when it comes early on but he starts to slowly start to lose his use as you start you get stronger and stronger because you don't need the aoe because you have literally miyuki you have the main character that we're going to talk about that in a second who can aoe you have shiki you have Vindabeth, you have Rikia, you have literally um, Shachiko as a, um, a tank can AoE and not take any damage. She takes less damage than Baryon is. You have Phoebe, which she pretty much is if you top up for one time. Beatrice AoEs, um, Yuffie AoEs, like you just have so many characters that AoE that you don't need your tank to actually do it. So that's when Kiraya starts to be more important because what Kiraya does is she actually is a tank that throws her the shield and she throws the shield in a column. So you can put her in the second column or the first column depending on where you decide. If you decide that you want to protect somebody, you can even put her in the last column if you need some type of spot protection on your main character if he's somehow in trouble. So you can kind of, you know, mix and match and put things where you see fit. Now, the reason why we're talking about this is is that the game is built for you to decide every day what you want to do. Now, do you want to work on your gear? Do you want to work on your main character? Do you want to work on characters themselves? So now back to what I was saying about actually what do I want to do in a day? Now, you have a limit on how much stamina you can get in a day. Now, you see I already used stamina um, for my daily spam. And what my daily spam is usually on the trials. What I do is I spam these according to how much um you know pretty much how much bread that i have to get the currency that i need to actually level my characters and build my uh Lucifer if i want to uh, let's do this now get that uh and you see i'm up to 118 now i've done all the trials of the day i've done most of the daily stuff always do your daily quest get that out the way um you want to get Kalash Dream Raw and Mac going to get it on. We can gift somebody right now. We might as well gift her because we are going to be using her. You also want to make sure that you always are getting the dates out and, well, not necessarily dates, but you just want to make sure that you're doing this because this is power for the characters and we're going to be using her because she's going to replace Baroness. This is also good for things like, you know, the new PvP thing that we have going on right now where you have more characters to throw out there that's going to be stronger. Hit the button. All right, so these are not necessarily helpful for her, so we're not going to do that. We'll just come back later when we get more, and we'll work on that. So we did that now, which pushes. You should always be doing this every day. There's no reason not to be doing this every day because it's too easy. All right, so again, we are going to be working on replace the Baroness, even though he's at 102 already, it's fine. I'm gonna take his gear off. Fast unequip. I'll put some other temp gear on him in a bit, because I still use them in other places. Uh, where is she? There she is. So bam. So what we're gonna do now is why are you talking so much? There we go. Now what this does actually is push me to actually use currency. Well stamina currency because I'm gonna have to level her. And if you're at this point right now, it's not that costly. All right, so we're looking good for the most part. And as you can see, my gold is slowly going down.
All right, so now we have to go and get parts, which is going to take the bread that I was talking about, your stamina. All right, guys, here's the final uh, where we're at right now. I ran out of resources. Again, this is why I was saying that you pretty much have to choose what you want to do in a day. Now, what I could actually do is I can go in and actually use one of these cards. Now, I actually have five of them, which I used from the event. So we're going to do that. I'm going to use all these cards right now. And I got that from the, uh, I'll show you. Let's just use all this now, since I'm here. Now you don't naturally have that. You get it basically from in here, which is pretty much the great fortune and, and the redemption. I went after all these because it's useful as you guys can see i can even go after the um the nightmare bottle too um if i need it right now it's useful for power now getting um shiki shards is actually useful but you can do that slowly on your own so what i decided to do is go after the stuff that i need right now as far as um power and build up my character and then whatever I have time I have left, I'll just buy the shards, which, you know, which is probably going to be literally now I have 15 days to get the rest of the shards or whatever else. Or if I want to go for the broken um, destiny prism stuff, I could do that as well. But I chose power over the one character. All right. So back in here, um, I put temporary gear on Barnes because he's still going to be used actually in the PvP event, the 10 Saints. So he's still going to be used there. And maybe anywhere else that um, forces me, like if they have some type of event where you have to use all tanks or something like that, then he's still going to be useful. But that's the point where he's at right now. So I ran the resources right there. We see, we just got some more. So we're going to use this now. Get us up to 99. So now we're at 100. Which I now need to spam this out now, but I literally have none, and I'm gonna have to actually go ahead now and use all of my stamina stuff, and now start buying stamina again, which is probably gonna take another one to actually get out there. Might take two more actually, which kind of sucks, but no, nope, we just made it. All right, so that puts her up at 100 now. So what I do from here is we're going to spam out again. It's going to take us to 104. Which pushes her at an okay level. This is all we're going to get for right now. So here's the thing. What I can do is I could go ahead and try to use currency on buying more gold, which I'm not. And just wait until tomorrow with whatever gold I have left and, you know, go from there. Now, again, I didn't do anything with gear because I don't have any um, resources with gear wise to actually go ahead and do that. And it gets expensive once you get towards the fourth and fifth one to actually spend on that. So we just chill for here and start going after stage stuff so now that i've done that no not you we'll see you in a second now we can go after stage stuff because i kind of come close to restoring myself back to what i was barring. um power wise i lost about 2k in power because she's not as strong as he was and i don't have her at the maximum gift level yet which i probably could that's 10 saints i probably could get myself back up to there I do this get her up to our uh, date level as I call it six uh, we do have coin right there I'm actually probably gonna get up to that 5k again all over again uh, let's snatch all that BAM and we're gonna be not so broke and we'll snatch all this up. Let's use all these and see if we get some parts. Uh, we got an Anna part, Vivian, Ashwella, 
meal, five shards, cool. And we have these boxes that I just never use. More cool. All right. Oh, I might as well use this too. Hello. Always scares me when it does this. Can we can we catch up now? Bruh. There we go. Thank you. All right. So now I know this is taking a little while. We can go back. And go in here and snatch up a little bit more. We're going to summon at the end of this too. This is going to take a little bit of time to show you the process of everything again. I didn't. I'm actually going to talk. It's, it's probably funny enough. It's probably my ex-wife telling me about my kids because the only person who talks to me on Google Hangouts. We'll get to it. Okay. Alright, we're not gonna do that. We'll just go to five. So now she's up to five. And only thing that we have left to do right now, see I'm pretty much done with everything that I'm naturally gonna do for the day. So we can fast level up that. Fast level up that. Um, go ahead and lead a level max already. Lead a level max on that. Let's go for attack. Already did that already. Did that already. So now, I think we might, we, we actually might be fully caught up, which it took a while. I was actually behind for a while. We fully caught up. So with that said, you don't have to use any more your crystals. You go in here and you start to work in here. This is just a little bit of a, um, just a hindsight to work on your balance and figure out where and what you want to go and actually do. Because you see how much it costs to actually level something in here. So we'll do that and push it at eight, which is expensive as hell. As you guys can see, but now you can turn around and do stuff like this. Now, this is actually literally going to take this. Uh, we can build a new one right here, so let's build it. Let's do that. It, this has to be uncomfortable. You have to have a minus A cup for that not to be uncomfortable for you. It just it just is. All right, so we could max this out. Oh, they're, they're on break, so I'm not going to spend anything on that. But this helps gold output. And now that we're ahead, I can start using a little bit of this on leveling all this up so we get more passive benefit out of all this. And that works, and you see my comfort. Um, sure. No date. You get no date. There you go. Everybody good in here? Everybody's good. Alright, so now we're done with all that. The only thing that's left is make sure that all your quests are done. Which they are. Oh, I'm gonna do something more. Okay, all that's done. I think all the daily stuff is done. Yeah, all that's done. There's no reason for you not to do the daily stuff. Like, just get it done. If you can't win in PvP, keep refreshing until you can actually beat somebody. It'll work out for you. All right, uh, as far as that, the only thing left to do at this point is whatever trial stuff that you have to do, and then just try to do stages here and there with your stamina, and then come back the following day and get it done so what we're gonna do is we're gonna summon now now that we've done everything in a day up i'm gonna get five of these 
can I actually... Or do I have to just buy it? They don't... Oh, there we go. So we'll do that. And we'll try again for her and see what happens. Come on, Anna, get out here. Make it easier on me. Nope. Not the hero we were looking for. However, we did get a bunch of parts, which is fine. So what we're going to do is, because we need more parts for her, we're going to go over here because we got 20. Let's see what happens. Even if we don't, we get duped stuff. It's, it's all good. And then we might get Yuffie. No Yuffie. Alrighty. One more. Then I save my currency and wait for whatever the next banner is. I gave it a good try. Oh, so we hit somebody here. If it's one of the two, it's a dupe because we already have both. Yuffie do. All right, and we get the dust from that as well. Nice. So we didn't get any more Karaya. She she didn't want to come out because she wasn't photo bombing. And can you can you believe I went to twenty nine on this, but this asshole didn't come out. And she's my favorite, and she didn't even come out. Bruh. Bruh. I mean, it went 80 times and she didn't come out in this band. <laughs> Are you serious? Alright, whatever. So, that's all I got for you guys. Be legendary. Actually, you know what? That's not all I got for you. It's not done yet. Because the way that this game works, we have so many codes. This game just don't know how to behave when it comes to codes. So here's some new codes for you. Some new codes. Bam. They don't know how to act with Illusion Connect. They just give you mad codes. Most re-rollable game ever. Easily. Easily. I think one of them I did already. I think I think there's one code I did. More curses. I think this one I did already, but we're gonna do it anyway, just to see. Yep, cleaned it already. But you got three more codes for you to hound that and get it. So now, if you want to see more of Illusion Connect on the bottom right, you can watch it. Have at it on the bottom left is Height Watch, where we just talk about the latest stuff that's coming. And yeah, I guys this is just a very given game and appreciate it and hope the other games act like them in the future catch you guys later peace